This is the G7 Ballistic Rangefinder, and I'm going to show you how to change the ballistic profile on the device. Now, you can store up to five ballistic profiles. That's five different guns or five different loads for one gun, but five separate and distinct ballistic profiles. So we want to change from profile four to profile number three. I have a 6XC that I want to shoot. So to access the main programming menu, I'm going to press and hold the mode button. With the device awake, I'm going to press and hold the mode button for five seconds. Now you can see I can program the backlight, the crosshair display, or the profile selection. That's what I want to change, so I'm going to press the fire button to select that. Now it displays that I'm currently on P4, which is a 7mm Remington. I want to go to the 6XC, which is P3, so I'm going to scroll with my arrows. I also have a 6.5284 and another 7 available. So I'm at 6XC, P3. Now to, to put this into the device, uh, uh, current memory use, I'm going to have to recalculate this profile by pressing the mode button. It takes 14 seconds to take those ballistic parameters and calculate the ballistic solution for what I've programmed in. It stores that information in the device and then when I measure a distance, it can calculate the actual solution. So it takes just 15 seconds, 14, 15 seconds to make that calculation. And once it's done, it returns us to that main programming menu. So I've got crosshair, profile, and backlight. I have to return one more level to that main firing menu. So press mode one more time. Now you can see in the top right hand corner I've got P3 selected, which is my 6XC, and I'm ready to press and hold the fire button to get a range.